Good morning all. Today we're going to uh, finish up the landing gear, the struts, the cool axles which are different on the A6 than any other plane I've ever done and finish up the gear doors etc etc. We're going to get it all done and put it to bed because I'm kind of tired of it. <laughs> Anyhow we'll uh, move on and get them all uh, finished up for you. So, uh, one thing, I've uh, added all the links to the tools and materials that I use in uh, all my bills. I look for the best quality and uh, the best prices. So, uh, check them out. Okay, I'm going to uh, finally install these uh, struts. Now, I'm actually going to glue them on because I've had all kinds of trouble with these things. I don't know if it's just they're too long or uh, what the problem is but they're always uh, coming loose and I've used every method I know to man so what I'm going to do is actually put some uh, glue which is shoe glue in this case and I'm just going to smother it on there because it's easier if I ever bend a pin or whatever, it's easier just to actually whip out the weed tract and uh, pop them on. So I've got a couple of group screws in there. So we're going to just gently ease it down. And then I need to uh, set the uh, toe in for the uh, wheels. So what I'm doing here is uh, these axles are quarter inch. So I'm using a quarter inch uh, brass tube and uh, I just put it across the gear and that straightens them up. And now that the glue is drying, uh, once that's dried, I'll uh, then tighten up the grub screws and uh, we'll all be nice and straight. Righty. Um, what I'm doing right now is uh, I've set the uh, zero um, toe in, if you will or the angle for the uh, wheels so now because we've got these guys spray out like this or splay out i should say um if i don't bend the axles then the wheels will be slanted in like this now this is one i did a few years ago and i've kind of improved that um so this is one i've just done i'm going to now do this axle so I'm going to try and, this has a bit too much angle in. So what I'm going to do is uh, re-bend it all and try and get it more like a vertical one like that one. All right, so I've got my little uh, miraculous bender uh, in the uh, vise here. And the other one I put in like this. And then I get my bending bar. Now I did have a mark. <laughs> And unfortunately, it rubbed off after I did the other one. So I think I saw the same place. So I'm going to try and get it correct. Okay, so I just have to be able to bend it to that position there, I hope. I've uh, marked the length of the axle. So now it's time to uh, cut this thing. filed the uh, slot in there as you can see well maybe not to see too well there we go all right it's time to uh, assemble the axle and wheel so let's see that one goes like that and we have the bronze bushing and we have just a spacer washer uh, that goes on there like that so I've assembled the, uh, the collet on the outside of the wheel. I've double uh, washered it. I've got a bronze washer uh, on the inside for the wheel itself to rub against. So now what I've got is this template here, which has one degree of negative towing. So I've set everything up. So what I'm going to do now is just snug this guy up a little bit and we're going to put an indent in the axle so i can mark the axle 
So I get a slot filed into it to reduce the possibility of losing everything. There she be. So I'll unassemble it again, take it over to the uh, vice, and we'll get a slot filed in. All right, so we've got the axles done, the angles are done. Uh, they've been re-secured at the bottoms. So let's see if this thing works now. So uh, what are we up? Gear down. So we go gear up. Doors are opening. Everything's clearing. Let's just recheck. So gear down. Okay, well, I've got one of the grub screws just scraping by the uh, the landing gear mount. So I'll just uh, sand those out and then they'll be good to go. So next is we're going to install the uh, wing tube, I believe. And then uh, I'm still waiting for bearings for the fans. And we'll do a rebuild of all the motors and the fans and then install those with the ducting. So that's going to come uh, probably next, because uh, it should be on the way. If you like what I'm doing, uh, please subscribe and uh, give me a thumbs up. It helps the channel.